Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing really, really well. If you're new here, then hi, I'm Rama and I do men's fashion and beauty videos. So if you like those kind of stuff, then please make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel. Now, I have been getting a lot of, lot of uh, Instagram messages and people literally ask the same question over and over again. And this is, how do you get your skin so glowy and how do you get like a, this radiant glow or why is your skin so glowy or how do you get this glow and stuff like that is all about glowing in skin now in today's video i'm gonna give you guys my top 10 tips and how to get a glowing skin these are the kind of tips i do and they have helped me a lot in order to get a nice glowing skin now at the moment i'm really really happy with my skin and stuff like that so Hence why I get loads of these kind of questions so on my Instagram. So hopefully these steps should help you guys as well in order to get a nice glowing skin. So tip number one would be cleansing and it is cleansing all the impurities. Now with cleansing I mean you have to wash your face every single morning and every single evening. Now it is very very important that you wash your face just before when you wake up and when you go before sleeping time and uh, with this you will make sure that you have a very nice cleansed face you are getting all get rid of those uh, bacteria those impurities that is lying around on your face especially when you wake up obviously um, on your pillow you may, you not, might know that there is lots of bacteria on your pillow cases so definitely wash your face every single morning with hot water and also in the evening if you use a face wash it is amazing if you use a face wash make sure you're using a face wash every single morning and evening and with this you will get rid of all of the impurities and you have a very nice cleansed face ready for your moisturizer tip number two would be serums now i love face serums now i have spent a lot of lot of money during lockdown on serums because i just like to try different type of serums and i'm a bit obsessed with serums i feel like they're very powerful skincare product and they really work now i love a good serum if it's a nice hydration serum nice nourishing nice oil based serum a serum with nice new texture or a serum that gives nice hydration a serum that fills in those wrinkles and those dehydrated lines i am all here for it and i like to try out different types of serums now with serums they could be a little bit more pricey and i highly suggest you guys to splurge the money on a good quality Good, it's like a piece of clothing a good quality pair of serum a good quality uh, serum product because they really work and it's definitely worth it serums are full of um, nice beneficial ingredients that really work wonders on your skin and I feel like serums are something that not most people use I feel like guys they hardly use use any serums the only use thing they use is just a face wash and a moisturizer and that's it Serum, they don't even know what a serum is about. Some people, but majority of people do, which is great. So serum, I feel like, are very important. I use serums every single evening because I like to get all of the hydration in the evenings. I try to skip the serum in the mornings because I feel like my moisturizer is powerful enough. So I use the serum every single evening. And when I sleep with it, the next morning when I wake up, I have a very nice hydrated face thanks to my zero the third tip is a very common tip and you guys must be laughing and it is h2o drinking a lot of water water is so important i feel like i shouldn't i shouldn't be really including this into my uh, tips but i have to do it and i have to remind you guys that water is very important now i have literally stopped drinking fizzy drinks i don't drink any coke or any fanta even though i love fanta i only drink it on occasions that i feel like it but in general i drink like two liters water a day and or maybe one maybe two sometimes one but i try to drink as much as water as i can sometimes i know we all forget to drink water Some, like i'm guilty of like sometimes i can't be asked like i can't be bothered to drink that boring water I like to put some uh, lemon into my water to make it more different and tasty. Water is very important. It gets rid of all of the impurities. It really cleanses your whole body and your face. And uh, once you have a cleansed body and cleansed skin, 
you have a very nice glow from within so water is very important combining the previous tip to the next tip would be avoiding alcohol or smoking now alcohol again is not very good to have this kind of liquid inside your body and the smoking again is very bad because it kind of is like a anti-aging for your face basically it's like a not anti-aging, it's like aging for your face. Uh, smoking is not good for your face. In general, for your teeth as well, it's not great. And you will have bad skin. And I shouldn't be talking really much about alcohol and smoking because you guys know the bad disadvantages about those because I am not a smoker and I'm not a drinker. So yeah, uh, moving on with the next tip. Uh, tip number five is using sunscreen. Now I'm very guilty because I sometimes forget to use sunscreen even though it's winter time I feel like oh we shouldn't use sunscreen because it's, the sun is not out but the sun rays are there and you just want to make sure you want to protect your skin so sunscreen is always in my skincare routine I always use it and uh, sunscreen again is another protection of a layer that helps to protect the skin against the sun rays and also it's also good for anti-aging the skin so sunscreen again is something I use every single day uh, even though when I'm not going out during this lockdown but sunscreen is very very important and very crucial and very vital the one that's my favorite is from Kiehl's I thought I filmed I think a dedicated video about the sunscreen I'm gonna leave here a link in the eye but definitely check it out if you haven't already I'm explaining all about the benefits of sunscreen and also the benefits of those products definitely go and check it out tip number six is all for those people that have sensitive skin if you have very redness if you're breaking out from all of the products that they're using then go for products which are paraben free sulfate free as well as um, fragrance free if you're breaking out or if you have redness then definitely check out those ingredient lists because the ingredient lists they do matter they have all the ingredients listed and sometimes harsh chemicals is not very good for the skin in general so if you're breaking out definitely stop using the product and look out for products that really are organic very natural very have less chemicals brands like CeraVe uh, simple are brands that you can go for and they will really really help to have a very nice um, basic routine with less chemicals because sometimes chemicals that are not great my seventh tip would be for all of the people who are makeup and it's definitely to wash up the makeup before you go to bed. Um, I don't like to go with full on face or to sleep under my pillowcases. No, no, it is not a good look and uh, your pillowcases will just get dirty and what's the point of it? So definitely wash your face before you go to sleep. Um, with the makeup just remove all the makeup use your toner use your makeup remover your micellar water and stuff like that and use your face wash in order to get rid of all of the makeup because the makeup is one of the most problematic thing that will cause breakouts and skin acne and also um, you will have a very nice glowing skin if you wash everything off because your skin feels very nice and cleaned afterwards my eighth tip would be to eat healthy. Now eating healthy is very important because whatever you intake in your body definitely will show from within and it will show also from the outside. So eating healthy means uh, reduce the amount of fat, fat that you eat, the very oily food that you eat. Now oil the food is not very great for um, breaking out and also sugary food will also cause uh, breakouts so definitely have a look in your diet and whatever you eat because the eating will also help you um, a lot definitely have you fruit and vegetables because the fruit and vegetables are there that will help the skin to clear and also they're very uh, natural kind of food intake that you can have and i would just suggest to uh, have a look in your diet, have a look what you eat because your um, food intake is as equally as important, you know, and um, I would highly suggest you guys to do your research as well because you'll be surprised what kind of food is bad for your skin and what kind of food is good for your skin. Number nine would be exercise. Now exercise is so important. You need to make sure if you're taking good things um, in your body, also the outside, make sure you're fit. Go to the gym, do some exercise, do some running and just have a good workout because the workout also gives this kind of glow. Just this overall lifestyle if you have the glow will come from within. Honestly, if you're feeling healthy, if you're feeling well, 
the glow it just comes like that and um, exercising is so important now I joined the gym it's been now one and a half years ago or nearly two years ago and I feel so much better with my body I feel so kind of fit I feel so uh, energized and stuff like that obviously lockdown all the gyms are closed which is very, very annoying but in general making sure that you do your push-ups do your sit-ups you know and all of these kind of things workout related will definitely help you and you will see a massive difference if you start slow next time you will be much more bigger tip number 10 and the last tip would be to have enough sleep now sleeping is very important again something related with lifestyle when you have a nice sleep you won't have any puffiness underneath your eyes your whole face feels more awake feels more energized and more glowy from within again now sleeping i love my sleep i have to have enough sleep because if i don't have enough sleep i'll have like three cups of coffee a day and i feel very moody and i feel very low so sleeping is again very crucial very important in your lifestyle and i feel like sleeping we should all making sure that we do in a nice kind of time frame now i like to have to have a sleeping pattern and also a nice timing pattern so i know okay this time i'm sleeping and this time waking up this is like my uh, routine and if you have a nice routine everything will fall under the place and everything will fall amazingly uh, after the other so definitely sleeping and drinking water drinking uh, a lot of water having fruit and vegetables um, making sure you're exercising stuff like that's so all these kind of lifestyle tips which is a lot in my list compared to other things but these lifestyle tips are working a lot much more than the products that you use so lifestyle changes are very crucial and very important and it has nothing to do with the products it has nothing to do with whatever you use on your skin because if you don't change yourself from within none of those high-end products none of those products will help your skin to grow all right you guys so these are my top 10 tips for how to get a glowing skin hope you guys all found this video very helpful and interesting if you didn't please give the video a like and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like these and do let me know if you guys want me to do more kind of skin related videos in the comments down below follow me on my instagram at Rama Bakshi. thanks so much for watching until next time i will see you in the next one